So we intend to empower our members. We intend to fo do focus groups. And in the words of past president Dongdong Bagatsin, we, have, we want to make sure that no member would feel like an orphan. Next. Okay. Community development. As you know, when I first uh, ran as a director, I was the director for community development. So in the following year, we intend to do projects on a long-term base. Don't expect 50, 100 projects, but expect 10, 20 worthwhile projects that will uh, be more uh, important to the community. Next. Individual development. Um, we are all here to join the chapter because we want something for ourselves. Uh, so it's important to still have all the gamut of activities that we, we normally have. You know, we have sports, we have fellowships, but we are looking more and more to to developing the complete individual. Hindi lang laging sports, hindi lang laging ganito. We want a complete package. So we intend to um, activate a lot of sports clubs and hobbies and ideas so that you know we keep the members' interest going and we again we're looking for the complete member. International, as you know, and I'm, I'm sure most of us are aware of this, we are bidding for ASPAC in 2011. As part of our five-year plan, uh, which will culminate in 2011, uh, hosting of uh, uh, ASPAC in Manila, we are seeking um, a lot of members to join us in all our uh, all of our trips abroad, especially uh, to ASPAC Nagano next year, which is our bid year. So. We hope that most of you, if, all, if not all of you, can join us in Aspect Nakano. Um, we also want to strengthen existing ties with all of our chapters and sister chapters. Uh, national relations uh, is equally important as international simply because without the national base, uh, even if you get the bid, nothing will happen. No one will support you. And uh, as the saying goes, no man is an island. In other words, JCI Manila, no matter how great we are, we are not an island, so we need the support of everyone. Um, the next two that I want to show are business and government. Traditionally, BISGO is one directorship. This year, we intend to break off business and government into separate uh, directorships. Why, do we, why are we doing this and what happens to special projects because of this? Special projects, the projects and special projects, we will distribute evenly to where it matters most. For example, um, Blessed Teresa would most likely go to community development and so forth and so on. Um, but with business and government, the reason why we are splitting the two is because we want equal importance for both directorships. We want the two directors handling these two, um, uh, again, directorships to, to really focus on uh, doing a lot of worthwhile projects that will seek to enhance our image.